Hey YouTube, you have to uh, forgive my cold. There'll be some sniffling in this video, I'm sure. What you're looking at here is a Mike Snowdy Menace in Damascus. You're looking at the hollow grind side. Forgive the ceiling fan messing with the light here. Try to get you guys the best focus I can with my iPhone. You'll see it's a deep hollow grind here. With no secondary bevel. Just ends. On this side it is flat. So it's a form of chisel grind with a secondary bevel. Just like the other menace I did a video on. It has a very unique profile. Let's see if I can focus it. That's not really focusing. Gives it a kind of special edge geometry. I believe Mike calls it a zero grind. So this is the grind that put him on the map back in the day in one of his vids. I don't know what form of Damascus this is. I was never told. It looks like a ladder pattern to me when I view it on this side. I see the ladder to it. But at the same time on this side I do see a little bit of a ladder to it but it almost looks like a raindrop this one also has his Japanese style wrap handle he uh, coats it or impregnates it with some sort of resin and It's as hard as polymer or plastic. It's pretty nice. You can't you can't shift that stuff on there. Provides a great grip. Almost too aggressive to this wonderful knife. You'll see he didn't etch the end on the pommel here. He polished that. Here, I'm like humans for targets right there. Ow. <laughs> he polished the end of it, which I thought was a nice touch. It looks good. I expected it to be etched when it showed up. The Snowdy logo, see if I can catch it. Here, maybe I'll give you guys some. Uh... There we go, it might be too bright. Let's see right above the handle wrap with the money sign for the S. Yes. There's really not a lot to say about it. It's a nice knife. I'm enjoying having it. Not sure if I'll keep it in the collection forever. Uh, he also rounded the spine on these. Not quite as round as my other menace. Here, I'll set it here for a moment. Oh, and the lanyard came with more of like a monkey fist type knot. As compared to the other one, it was just tied. Came with a black leather sheath. In comparison to the brown leather of my CPM 154 Menace. This one's the Boss Bailout Snowdy Special or Bailout Snowdy Shank. He rounded the spine on this one a little more. He did not get the grind on the tip as nice. You see the flat into the round. It's much better on that one. Same handle wrap. And they're all slightly different. This Damascus is the third one I've had. I had two of these. Gave one to a buddy as a gift. 
they were both different in their own little way. And, you know, the outlines are pretty much the same. The grinds are a little different. Anyways, I thought I'd share it with you guys while I had the opportunity. It's a nice little knife. I'll probably move both these along in the future. I thought I was going to keep them. I was excited to get them, but now that I have them, they're just, uh, they're not really what I was after. So, I'm going to move them along. Anyways, thanks for watching. Everybody stay safe.